Hi, this is Mark Gregg, Magis Innovations, uh, showing you how to hook up the Ultimate Attenuator and demonstrate it with an amplifier. This is a 50 watt Marshall. So basically, uh, let me turn this around so I can show you the hookup. It's very simple. The amplifier goes to the input marked amp on the attenuator, and then the input marked speaker goes out to the speaker. And then we're using the 100 volt tap with the amplifier, which is right here. And what that allows you to do is drop the voltage about 10%, which is great for uh, vintage type amps. Um, we have a, a voltage selector, so you can use it with 220 or 110 worldwide use. Uh, variable line out so that you can uh, uh, run another amplifier and effects with it. It's got a plexi switch, which is a bright switch, which is good for uh, Marshall type amps, and you might want to leave it off on fenders. It's up to you. And a bedroom switch, which allows you to drop the volume very low, and we have an on and off power switch because it's basically a, uh, uh, built, it's got a built-in amplifier inside of it. So what you want to do is probably use a two, first thing you want to do is get one of these two to three adapters and um, plug it in probably to the amp if you're going to use the tap. And if you're not going to use the tap, plug it into the attenuator and that'll lift the ground. That way um, you, it'll avoid a uh, 60 cycle hum, which can be really irritating. Okay, that's it. That's the hookup. Here's the front panel of the attenuator. And uh, basically my friend Scott Hathaway here on guitar is helping me out. And uh, we're going to show you uh, why the Ultimate Attenuator is unique. Um, it's just got a volume and an on and off switch. When the switch is off, it's basically bypassed, stra amped straight through to the speakers with no circuitry. So that's bypassed there. Go ahead and play that, Scott. Okay, and then when we turn it on, it's the same. It's basically off, on, same. And then all you got to do is dial it back and then keep, go ahead and keep playing as I dial it back. And you can just set the volume wherever you want. No click, click, click. So like other attenuators that have different loads on each click is a different load. This retains the same load, so the, so the tone's the same all the way down. Go ahead and keep playing on it. And you can get it quite low. And of course the guitar's turned down too, so you can turn the guitar up a little bit. So that's pretty low, and you can even get lower than that with a bedroom switch. You can get so low that either the strings are louder than, than, uh, than the amplifier. So that's basically it. That's the, that's the hookup for the attenuator, and Scott Hathaway is going to play a little Led Zeppelin, hopefully, for you guys.